kind of kind of fit in right away. I knew some of the guys before I got here. Um, of course, n learning other guys' personalities that I didn't know. But everybody on the team is works, you know, on and off the court. We we gel together well, and I think that's what makes us a good team on the court because we can we can laugh and joke off the court as well. But they've all been positive for me, um, giving me a lot of confidence, um, kind of helping me in certain areas. I've been working with some of the players um, after practice. Uh, just to get me acquainted with with how they play and their style of play. Of course, they're a championship team, so coming in and trying to trying to be a be a spark and be and be a help of any kind is what I'm here for. Continue to to get better for sure. Um, also to to add any contribution I can to this team. Um, you know, of course, as a team, we want to win a championship again, and so that's kind of the goal. So we're taking it week by week uh, to make sure that we we go through those certain steps to make sure we're ready for the playoffs. For my four years at Belmont helped me tremendously um, to be able to play at this level. Uh, Coach Barry teaches discipline, uh, but also lets you become the player that you are. And that's kind of how it is here also. And you know, I can't speak enough of how playing at Belmont and those times with those guys especially um, kind of helped me for this time right here. We got a very close, close team. Chemistry is a big thing for us, uh, and the, the guys, they, the guys, uh, they, they they like Ian a lot. They include him in everything, and then, um, you know, every, you know, as a coaching staff, we don't see it all, but it seems like it's a, a good fit. Uh, we we like to keep good people around our organization, and uh, you know, like I said, he never complains whether he plays or not. Uh, you know, he competes, and there's a there's a a fine line of making sure you still you you're still getting after it and showing that you want to be on the floor, uh, but he does it and with a smile on his face and like I said he doesn't complain. So uh, you know as a person he's exactly what we're looking for and as a player he fits that role too. To be honest, I didn't know a lot about Ian, but the uh, the front office said he, he that he was had a great summer league and they you know brought him in and he came in pretty much every day. Before, uh, before workouts all throughout September. Uh, he was living up there and then came into training camp with a great attitude, continued to show up, work before and after practice. The guys on the team really liked him, uh, never complains. And every time we put him on the court, he, uh, he does good things for us. So we're, we're thrilled with him. Uh, you know, he can play multiple positions. He can play the point guard, the shooting guard. Uh, he's a, a good penetrator, he's a smart player, he can knock down the open three, uh, which is what we're looking for out of our guards. Um, and he, he competes on the defense end, which is also a big key for us. So he fits all those criteria. Uh, you know, it's early in the season and we have some vets on our team that, uh, that are going to get rest throughout the year. Um, so we expect him to be able to, whether we play him for three minutes or play him for 20 minutes on a given night, we expect him to come in and, and provide a, a spark for us and, and knock down shots and keep our, our, the rhythm and flow of our offense going. Want to play better, of course, but uh, it was it was it was just good. You know, it was always good coming home and playing in front of the family and friends, and uh, being able to to play. You know, as a pro in your home city. I would just stay consistent. Um, like I said, at times we play great and we kind of slack off a little bit, um, just individually and as a unit. Um, so I think we we all can get better in those in that aspect and kind of continue this the streak that we got going. It's big, and you watch them every day. I watch them every day after practice. Uh, during practice, after practice, getting their work in, working hard, and it trickles down from you know the two best players into everybody else on the team. So uh, for me, you know, I watch, I talk to Steph a lot, watch his game, and, and kind of help him. I mean, he helps me, um, you know, kind of incorporate some of the things that he does in my game. Go Bruins!